Hi everyone, Gleb Bakhmutov is here and I want to show you an issue open in the Cypress repository. The issue says that include text does not match text when used inside the Monica editor. There are screenshots of a failure, of a part of a text that's relevant and then a code to reproduce it. So thank you very much for opening a very good issue. I clone the repository and I see the spec file with the commands. So the first command passes, the second one fails. You can see the command failing. So let's look at the test. The first passing assertion says include text game. And the second failing assertion fails with game of life, which includes spaces. So something is different about those two assertions. So I can see the game of life in the code editor right here. Uh, let's see what kind of text it is because HTML can mount the text differently. So if I select this string that we're trying to find, we can see that inside the code editor, it actually shows non-breaking spaces instead of spaces. This is a special character. It's not a regular space character. It's a special HTML entity. And what can we do? Why doesn't it work? Well, the one thing that we should always do is search Cypress documentation. Here's what I will do. I'll go to the docs and I'll say search. And I'll start saying non-breaking space. And it leads me to the site contains command that says that if you're using non-breaking space entity like non-breaking space, then you should use site contains command. So let's see if that works. I'll go back to my text editor and instead of site get should include text, I'll say site contains. And site contains can take the CSS selector as the first argument and then I'll say game of life. So now it's passing correctly because it is fine that this element with the CSS selector actually contains this text and it handles non -breaking. Another thing that we should do when we search for non great space, we should see what else the search results return. In this case, we have a site contains API command, we have a filter command, and also we have FAQ question, which kind of seems relevant. How do I get an element's text content, which shows have text assertion? But then it says, if a text contains a non-breaking space entity, then use Unicode character because under the hood, those special HTML entities will be converted to actual characters inside the browser. So it says, if you expect to have non-breaking space entity, you should use this Unicode character. Okay, so let's see if I say sci get and should include text. So the have text matches the whole text string because we're only looking for part of the text we're using include text. So game of life and we're going to insert the Unicode character instead of non-break space. And now it's passing correctly. So what's the conclusion? Always use the search. The search is very useful. We're trying to answer as many questions and answer the questions that we think users might have Right. Um, at, at the best of our knowledge and be as helpful in our task.